That's a fish. Official handoff right here for the yep. boat. All right. I just says you picked up your boat and we didn't give it to a twin brother or somebody. <laughs> you laugh, we've had it happen. What? You see, what's the date today? 29? 29. Okay. That's that's insane. Yeah, I we would. have had it happen. People have been supposed to be somebody's brother oh. or All right. supposed to be somebody that they're not. It's officially our boat now. Let's go. The first official raft. Uh, just adventure. I'm going somewhere right now, guys, where I've never gone before in my life, where I'm going to be overnight camping it with my boy Jack. You guys saw him in the last video. We're going to be with him in Boca. Trying to get him a little bit of a redemption, man. Like, I freaking get, I got that giant king and hadn't even touched the fish, so I felt kind of bad. I'm going to make sure that he's dialed this trip. I brought an extra setup for him just to make sure he's freaking perfectly dialed. And uh, it should be a cool little salmon camp. So I'm headed up north right now, and I'm excited to get... He's calling me right now. Guys, I'll see you up north. Dogs hitting Boca over here. Little bokey dokies. Artichokies. What's up, buddy dog? We're gonna be hammock camping. It's been a little bit. Um, it's been since that last video, for sure. So, is there a second one over there? No, oh, dude. All right. Well, let's see if the pan freaking, <laughs> dude. It's it's literally like straight rust. Like I'm just gonna be honest right now. This is 100% rust. Um, we'll just re-season it, I guess. I mean, have you done this before? Um. I have no idea how much oil to like do this with. If anybody actually does know what I should do when your entire cast iron skillet is completely rusted, like what do you do? I've seasoned it many times, but I don't know. Do you think that's enough oil? No, I'll put more on. That's <laughs> so crazy. Straight up hibachi out I here. I bought it just. That's how it's supposed to be, brother. Yeah, he'll sit there like he's not, though. This one should turn out better. Do you ever make like breakfast for dinner though? Oh, all the time. I make bacon, eggs, and toast like 8 p.m. All, all the time. time. There was there was two years, if not three years, uh, in a row where I was omelets or nothing. For real? Yep. <laughs> I love it, dude. Yeah, I mean, just broken. That's it's, it's a freak. <laughs> Leave a comment if you eat these f***ing eggs, because I don't know, man. If I can just say this dog. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah. Or if you want to eat the dog, yeah. <laughs> This is so I feel like I'm eating mud right now, like if I'm being honest. That's some that's some dirty. Just a little taco freaking breakfast sandy man. This is my third impression here. Dude, I can't be mad at all. Kinda sucks because we're gonna eat that salmon, but I don't know man, that thing was hard as a rock, so I'll take breakfast and this ain't bad at all, so. We're probably not going to eat anything tomorrow. The most realistic scenario right now for us, Jack, is we're going to wake up at like 4.30 a.m., maybe 5 o'clock, and we're just going to pound coffee. Probably not eat anything besides a handful of trail mix for eight hours. Yep. Per usual. So hopefully this holds me over. One of the hardest parts of crashing the hammock. No weird pee picks. Is I in the perfect position, sitting perfectly. But honestly, this ain't too bad. All right, guys, that's gonna be it for me. I'm going to bed. We gotta get up at 5 a.m. Got the boat ready. Everything's packed up. And could bang on a couple kings.
Was that the best sleep of your life, or what? No, quite a, the opposite, actually. I heard you. <laughs> oh, boy. I'm irritated right now. Really? I just got my hammock, whole campsite packed up. It's like 5 a.m., got Jack up, we got Boca. It's time to hit the river. It's freaking gay, dude. I'm stoked. This is terrible. Like, this is terrible. Is that all you have? No, I got, I have some that I thought out, but this is the stuff that's already thawed, so I just. Gotcha. All right, guys, we're out here right now. It's what, probably 5.15? No, it's way freaking later than that. It's like 6 o'clock. Now, we've been up for like the last hour just getting our boat together, cutting up skein, getting our rods all rigged up. We had some interesting portages, and uh, it was a rough night, dude. I like, I slept like complete crap. I'll be honest. I woke up to Jack being like pretty pissed off. I'll be honest. <laughs> it was like, dude, I looked at the weather, it was 85% humidity. I don't know if you knew that. It was 65 degrees, 85% humidity, and uh, slept like crap. But we're fasted, haven't eaten anything, we're on coffee right now. We just chunked up our skin, got our rods ready, and we're seeing the first light right now. So we're going to try to get Jack on a little redemption tour here. Last week we were a little down bad when I pulled that PB, but uh, it's, it's a new start and a uh, fresh beginning. So let's see if we can get him on a couple fish and have a good day out here. Yeah, this is for sure the most difficult. Ugh. Hold up. All right. It's getting a little deep for me. It's like no more portages, dude. That fucking tree that was in the way at one point. Dude, yeah, I don't think I'm ever gonna like do this again. Yes! They have officially turned on. Let me get my camera. Stopping my hand. Dude, I just turned that fish over. That was so satisfying. Dude, that is such a nice fish. Here. Oh, okay. Hold up. I'm on the verge of losing it. Okay. I'll get it to you, bro. Oh, that's freaking go, Jack. First fish of the day right there. Skein biter. He's ready, dude. Launching back in there, dude. Parking right back up. <laughs> Sick. Awesome. Finally. Finally. Like this hole was active from the jump. Dude, that was a fish, 100%. That's exactly, that's the cast, if you could do that every, I mean, that's the cast I got bopped on, so. Boom, dude, why didn't you set the hook? Man, the lighting is beautiful. You're going to hit one here, I'm telling you, bro, that skein is good. This is the good skein. First cast, new bait, right here, get right. Yes, dude, Jack, yes, I told you, dude. Down to the left, down to the left, down to the left. <laughs> Say thank you. I said I love you. Okay, that's better. 
Yeah, down left, down left. You want to torpedo him upstream. Yup, yup, yup. See? See how he see how he comes up with you right there? There you go. Reel down, reel down, down left, down left, down left. Yep. There you go. Yep, down left, down left, down left, down left. Tight and drag, just a touch, just a touch, reel, reel. Tight and drag, tight and drag. Damn son, yeah, son! <laughs> yeah, dude. <laughs> Try to go, dude. He's about to go on you. Yeah. You're gonna tighten or drag just a tick, a tick or two. <laughs> Jackery, let's go, dude. This boy bucked up. Yes, yes sir. Seven days of fishing. <laughs> Seven days of not catching a fish. I'll come down to this one right here. The Conservation Clam Series. Ready? Bazinga, bro. Send that boy. I know, I'm just enjoying them. Rehooks himself. Like, my skein hooked by one single egg right now. Slap me off that cliff. It's a cliff bar now. I'm telling you, dude, this bait is fire. I don't think this is why they're biting. I mean... Yep. Oh, God, my bail's open. Oh. Dude, that one's huge. That one was absolutely huge. Dude, my bail was open. It's going to happen first cast. Could be. I mean, we haven't touched all of them. I don't know. It's hard to say, though, because mine's tight and school from that last one. You just Mine hit right there, the last one. Yep, yep. That's a big fish. No. God. It's bad. Where is it? Please don't. Please don't. <laughs> Fish jumped seven feet out of the air. Dude, <laughs> I'm not even mad. Like I'm, uh, like honestly, you were landing that fish. No, <laughs> I was not. No matter what happened.